And as part of the AI Seoul Summit, South Korea hosted the AI Global Forum as well. There was also an AI Seoul Summit ministerial session held behind closed doors. So what are the takeaways from the science industry's top delegates and business circles from around the world? Our Ian He brings us the story. Held in collaboration with the AI Seoul Summit, the AI Global Forum hosted by the South Korean government brought together top officials, leading industry experts, and academic representatives from various nations. In the first session at the Korea Institute of Science and Technology in Seoul on Wednesday, experts discussed the future direction of global AI governance. For instance, how can the side effects of the technology be managed? Experts say that society will need to adapt to more capable AI systems. Fraud and cyber attacks, for example, could become more commonplace. What we'll need to do is we'll need to have things like um, spam filters, but on your phone. But I think these sort of adaptation interventions won't be enough. There's a lot of work still to be done, not only for private corporations, but the public. And as Marcus Anderlung put it, governments will need to intervene more. Big companies that have the power to utilize customer data for commercial purposes talked about how they safeguard consumer privacy. We are based on the usual agreement. So that means private blog data did not use for our training. Internet conglomerate's neighbor added that it is willing to further establish guidelines in collaboration with the government. Session 2 focused on integrating AI into the public sector and spreading the benefits with the world. Communications giant KT demonstrated what it's working on as part of its social responsibilities. First of all, we have developed Senior Well-Being Service, which uses AI to monitor the health and safety of elderly citizens. However, experts say when developing AI opportunities, the needs of the target region should be considered as they may differ. Meanwhile, at the convention hall, the AI Seoul Summit ministerial session was held behind closed doors. This year's AI Seoul Summit, hosted by South Korea and the UK, conducted a private ministerial session, building upon the foundational discussions from Tuesday's leader session and the first AI Safety Summit that was hosted last year by the UK. The session was co-chaired by Lee jong ho South Korea's Minister of Science and ICT, and Michelle Donnellan, the United Kingdom's Secretary of State for Science of Innovation and Technology. Key figures of the industry took part in in-depth discussions on AI innovation, safety and sharing the benefits. Through this forum, it was reaffirmed that South Korea has the capability and leadership to set agendas on the international stage. The minister added that South Korea will continue to collaborate with the global community to develop AI governance and safety. Yeonhee, Arirang News.